block 51 of the Tunisian Sampler Afghan is the double waffle block. And as you can see here, it's very similar to the waffle stitch. You do your chain and then um, instead of just bringing up one stitch in the spaces in between, what you do is you insert, bring up a loop, then yarn over and bring up another loop in that same chain. And you do this all the way across. And one of the things that I would caution you when doing this stitch is you want to keep it as loose as you possibly can. Otherwise, you're going to constantly be fighting pulling through. So now I yarned over, I pulled through one. Now I'm going to yarn over and I'm going to pull through four all the way across. Basically the one that's on the hook in the front plus that group of three that are together. And you have to do this all the way across. And if you're too tight, you're, it's a wrestling match since you're doing much multiple stitches here in each group. But that's in essence your double waffle. And then you'll come across and in the next row you're going to stagger. And that's how you get your waffle effect. Again, like the waffle stitch, at the beginning and the end you really need to look two rows below to make sure that you're staying straight, that you're not adding to the end or decreasing otherwise your your block will start going like that so that's the double waffle um, if it wasn't for the wrestling match with the stitches I really like it I kind of like the extra stitches in between um, but it's you know it, you really have to be relaxed uh, to keep this loose enough that you're not you know just gritting your teeth every time you're doing the second half of the row so that's block 51 the double waffle in the leisure Tunisian sampler book leaflet 2501 at leisurearts.com it's referred to as the double plane uh, years ago it was just the plain stitch and over time it's reverted to the waffle stitch so i'm referring to it both ways to just totally confuse everybody but you know in case you're following along in the leaflet you're not going to find a waffle stitch in there okay thanks for watching